Good afternoon everybody, how are you all getting on? <laughs> Hope you had a good Christmas and a good New Year. It's a bit of a funny old times again now, so not going to be able to get out much as usual. Story of my life really. Well, story of everybody's life, but self-cancelling indicators. Where are you? Oh, there you go. They're much needed. That's one thing that I do tend to do is you, if you watch any of my other videos I tend to leave them bloody things on. Anyway. Running in the old triple. Not done many miles. It's one thing with the triple. I can't see anywhere on the screen, on the display there where it shows like your, your, your mileage if you know what I mean. Only when you turn the bike on and then you turn the bike off that displays it. I might be wrong, it's probably somewhere. I haven't really fiddled around with it too much, but I have only had it a week. First impressions though. <laughs> oh, she is a beaut. She is an absolute beaut. The, the, the quick shifter is so smooth compared to my thousand. She sounds lovely as well. Being a triple 765cc, what I'm going to do is just going to put some fuel in. When they delivered this, oh, brakes are a little bit squeaky. I cleaned it the other day, so they're probably a bit, yeah. But yeah, when they delivered this, they delivered this with a full tank of fuel, believe it or not. A full tank of fuel, what about that? Thanks, Triumph. So I'm not going to squeeze that much in, but let's we'll see what it's like to fill up. <coughs> side stands very easy jump off the old bike turn her off oh I love the TFT as well lovely that key in we're gonna go for yeah let's have some premium premium fuel <laughs> not gonna get a lot in but <coughs> I'll have a little look and see. Oh. Again, you don't have to put super unleaded in or premium lead up uh, premium premium unleaded in in. You can just use normal. What we got? I've got more in than what I thought there. I think that'll probably do need to mind the old paint oh that's good <coughs> no worries there nice and easy yeah what an absolute beauty also I, went, I cleaned it the other day I went out and got it all shitty <laughs> quite quite uh, disappointing really yeah cleaned it all there's no radiator guard on here you'd have thought they'd have put a radiator guard on there keep all the shit off. I mean that was caked with uh, mud. Well there you go. <coughs> Never mind. Got the old tail tidy on there as well. Extras. Nice. Right. In we go. Hello. Hello. Yeah cheers. See you later. Bye. Yeah, I love this colour as well. This, I think it's ice silver, that's called. Ice silver. Yeah, lovely colour. There was a slight little scratch on here when they delivered the bike. I don't know if you can see it there. In transit, I believe, but they're going to sort that out anyway. Oh, 65 miles, that's all that's done. 65 miles, okay. The fuel gauge hasn't jumped up yet. Still on half a tank. We'll see how long that takes to, to move. I'm getting steamed up a little bit. See how long that takes to go up. Still not jumped up. See ya. Some of them take longer than others. Let's have a look. 
but yeah anyway first impressions of this bike I absolutely love it been for a couple of little rides out as you just saw then oh that's the fuel gauge going up nice full tank of fuel so yeah I've done 65 mile or something like that wasn't it I think the, the running stage is I think it's about a thousand mile but the first service is 500 at 500 miles that'll all be um, run in before long I don't like hanging around running them in I like to get them run in get the first service done oh you see the dash has just changed into to daytime running there it's got the auto dash it's brilliant yeah my first impressions are it's a good purchase got a little bit off as well by triumph by the dealer not loads i think being the end of the year end of 2020 i knocked a little bit off i had to pay for the tail tidy i think the tail tidy you forget now is about 100 but I, it's one of those things that i'd probably I'd, I'd, i need to i'd need to do but i'd never get around to putting one on <laughs> Oh yes, I know, it looks lovely, doesn't it? A lovely triumph! <laughs> oh, squeaky brakes. Let's have a look down here. Oh, she's a beaut. She's a beaut. Yeah, I think you have to go a little bit easy running it in. Keep the revs relatively sort of low through the gears. Obviously, I wouldn't be taking it on the track for a, for a while. There you go. Let's have a little look up here. Oh, so that quick shift is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just trying to avoid the, the damp patches in the road. <laughs> yeah, there's a few different settings on. I've had a little play with this. There's a few little few different settings where you can change the styles on the TFT screen just change the view and what have you I think that's my preferred one at the moment not so I haven't really been too far but so cold I'll tell you heated grips would be good maybe that's something I should invest in heated grips I did notice the other day when I was out my hands were like ice blocks well anyway, take care, it's a very short video, and if you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button, that'd be much appreciated, hit the like, and I'll uh, see you on, another on the next video, take care, speak to you soon.